Hey guys, so today I'm going to be making strawberry milk boba and this is the first time I've ever made boba. Um, one day when I went to World Market, it's like a store, I actually bought strawberry milk boba but I didn't have like a straw for it or anything and so like the little tapioca balls were at the bottom and it was kind of weird how it tasted. The strawberry milk is good. I like strawberry milk. And so I want to be making my own today. I already have my tapioca pearls uh, cooking in here. It depends on which ones you buy, but these are the ones I bought. I bought them at an Asian market. They're called a Suka brand. And they're these large uh, white ones. I have my macerated strawberries already ready. I have them chopped and then I put some sugar in there and I let that set and then I have my little jar here that I'm gonna use and you're supposed to use this top here and then put like a straw in but of course the boba straw won't fit so I'll just take the top off and put it in like that but yeah I have a whole set with these and they're really cute we can just use this for regular milk too and then I have my strainer here that I'm going to use, and then my blender so I can blend my strawberries and milk together. Now I'm ready to make my strawberry milk, and so I'm going to pour in my strawberries first. Willow wants some, but she definitely can't eat these because they've been sitting in sugar. And this Setting it in sugar helps like bring out all the nice strawberry flavor and you can see all this like nice liquid here Bring a nice flavor to the milk There we go, I'm trying to scoop all of it out and I have this cute little spatula with a little paw on it Oh, I missed one A little bit of the syrupy sugar here. There we go. And now I'm going to add my milk. You can add any milk you want. And now I'm going to pour this in just so it at least covers the strawberries. Okay. I think that's good. I can always add more of course if I need to. Now I'm going to Blend it all together. Now I'm going to strain this. You can see it's all nicely blended together. Willow was like completely barking at the blender. Um, but yeah, I'm going to strain this now. Just pour this in here. And this is just to get some of the strawberry seeds out. I grabbed a spat- I grabbed a spatula so I can try and like mix it a little bit. Of course I don't want to push the seeds through the um, strainer. But just to get all of this liquid out. So yeah, after I've been like kind of lifting it like this for a minute, you can see these are all the seeds in there that you want to make sure to get out. Okay, so there's that. I'll put this in here. So I can show you underneath. That's what that looks like. And now I'm going to put this in the fridge so it can be nice and cool while I wait for my tapioca pearls to finish cooking. I have my tapioca pearls here. You can see they're like completely clear. Can't remember. But yeah, this is about a quarter cup. And I these were cooked for about like two and a half hours because this bag doesn't have instructions. So if you want like exact instructions, probably get another brand. But we'll see how these turn out. And I'm gonna scoop some of it in here and see if this will be an easier way to get them in the thing. Because this is what 
they look like. So I probably won't be able to see them, but that's okay. Now I'm going to try and put them in here. Now I'm going to add my milk, just going to pour it straight in here. I'm going to fill up the whole thing. There we go. I pretty much used like almost all the milk and almost filled this whole thing. So yeah, you can actually kind of see some of the pearls in the bottom. If I put more in, you would be able to see it, but yeah, it's cool. Okay, I added more tapioca pearls. Will's going kind of crazy right now because she was running wild outside. <laughs> yeah, I added more tapioca pearls so you could see it because there wasn't that many. But I'm probably not going to eat all those. <laughs> but yeah, now it's time to try it. First, I'm going to try just the milk. See how it tastes. The milk is pretty good. So I think it was okay. Well, let me try with the pearls first, actually. Let's see how it is. Mm. The pearls aren't actually that bad. They don't really taste like anything to me. They're just like a little squishy. I think they're better than the ones that I had. It was like a, a little strawberry milk boba. It came in like a little a little can. I think I already said that because I couldn't fit a straw in there. But yeah, those pearls I think were a little bit bigger and they were like weirder tasting. Like I literally had to spit it out and only drink the milk. Um, but this one, it kind of doesn't like burst in your mouth. Like, let's see. Yeah, like they're chewy. I think if I like put this whole thing in the fridge so that way it'll like chill the whole thing, the tapioca pearls and the milk, I think I would like it a lot better. But yeah, I don't know if I would make this again. Maybe I could like, you know, make other flavors of um, boba tea. Well, this technically is a boba tea because this doesn't have tea in it. And I don't even think I've tried boba tea before. But yeah, I think it tasted pretty okay. If you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content.